I really don't know why it's so hard for some of y'all to understand that name calling is not going to get people to respect your opinion. You can't force the whole world to use your preferred pronouns, just like you can't force someone to go by cisgender. Your rights and your personal boundaries do not supersede the boundaries and rights of everyone around you. And you know, if it weren't for this whole superficial trans LGBT movement that is being pushed on children, well, 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 Gays Against Groomers has a conservative ring to it, don't you think? And you're sitting on an Instagram account with 256,000 followers. You even got a backup account with 46,000 followers, but you even got no content on it. That seems sus. That seems suspicious. And look how easy lies just roll off her tongue, right? If you look at this site, everything is geared towards the mutilation of children. This is the lie they're pushing that these children have no voice and they're being forced to change sexes. I can't even say some of the half of the crazy shit that's on the page because even Instagram itself has flagged multiple pages just for misinformation. That means it's complete fucking lies. You're batshit crazy. But this is what they do, right? This is a straight right wing page and they got these guys, I don't know if they pay actors, but you know, all of a sudden, all of these gay people that's over there, they're anti-gay. Same thing that we get with the conservatives, right? They're anti-black, they're just there to help push the right wing talking points. But hey, let's hear some more from her. Official trans LGBT movement that is being pushed on children Regular trans people will probably be living peacefully because they already have all the rights that we do. But now because y'all have brought the kids into it and you're bullying people who disagree with that, you're getting these really strict laws and you're surprised by the pushback. Boy, you gotta give her an A plus for her gaslighting skills, huh? Oh, but continue with the fascism. I gotta hear more of this bullshit. What's really sad is no one's gonna know what real transphobia is because y'all use the word too loosely. Respect is a two-way street, but some of you, you don't want respect, you want supremacy, and that is why you will fail. Well, there you have it, folks. Transphobic Karen has made her case. They are looking to drive a wedge between the black community and the trans community, and we must stand arm in arm linked together. This is nothing more than these radical uh, Christian nationalists who are trying to seep their way in every part of our life. They will not let us live in peace, and they definitely don't let the queer community live in peace. Whether it takes 10 months or 10 years, we must purge this country of white supremacy.